Hi, I'm Peter Burris, and welcome once again to another Wikibon Action Item Quick Take. David Floyer, you were at OCP, the Open Compute Platform show or summit this week, wandered the floor, talked to a lot of people. One company in particular stood out, Nimbus Data. What'd you hear? Well, they had a very interesting announcement of their 100 terabyte, uh, three and a half inch SSD, called the Exadata. That's a lot of storage in a very small space. Uh, it's uh, high capacity SSDs, in my opinion, are going to be very important. They are denser, much less power, less, much less space, not as much performance, but fit in very nicely between the lowest level of uh, uh, disk, hard disk storage and the upper level. So they are going to be very useful in lower tier two applications, very low friction for adoption there. Uh, they're going to be useful in, in tier three, uh, but they're not a direct replacement for disk. They work in a slightly different way. So the, 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 the uh, friction is going to be a little higher there. And then in tier four, there's again a very interesting of, of putting all of the metadata about uh, large amounts of data and put the metadata on uh, high capacity uh, SSD to enable much faster access uh, at a tier, tier four level. So uh, action item for me is uh, have a look at my research and uh, have a look at the, uh, the general pricing. It's about half of what a, a standard SSD is. Excellent, so this is once again uh, a Wikibon action item quick take. David Floyer talking about Nimbus Data and their new uh, high capacity slightly lower performance, cost-effective SSD.